I'm gonna come out and say it. Space depresses me. And it's not that I hate it. I'm a massive fan of futuristic spacey laser zapping lightsabery things. And apparently also a fan of making girls find me less attractive. But this video isn't about women, it's about space and how it makes me sad. I always get this weird feeling after I've watched a space documentary, a TV show about space, or a movie that explores the general vastness of the universe out there. And this isn't in a, I feel so small in the universe way, because as far as I'm concerned, the whole world revolves around me. At least, that's what my mum told me. My issue with space actually comes hand in hand with my constant desire to explore things. You see, I love going on adventures, so much so that whenever I have my car, I'll just drive somewhere, somewhere new, somewhere old, just go on a fun adventure with friends. I'll even hop on a boat or a plane abroad sometimes. But with space, I can't do that. Last week when I was in New York, I went to the Natural History Museum and saw their universe presentation, which explored the galaxy past the Milky Way. Pretty good, pretty exciting, really interesting. One problem being that it made me really want to go explore the world past the Milky Way. Can't do that. Thank you, museum. You've made me depressed. So I went the rest of the day feeling pretty lame because I knew that I couldn't go to space. That is the extent of my space depression. I will see space in the day, I will establish that I can't go there, and then for the rest of the day, there'll be this dark pit inside me where there's a void. And that void is space, because I can't visit space. And I want to visit space. Life isn't fair. I often think that my childhood and Pixar are to blame for the space depression. You see, on one hand, you have Buzz Lightyear going, to infinity and beyond. And on the other hand, you have Woody going, reach for the stars. Both telling me that space is in my reach and to go out there. And then I grow up and what? So that is space and why it makes me feel sad. Uh, let me know what small things that shouldn't make you feel sad make you feel sad down below for a like on if you like. And whatever. It snowed apparently in England and it happens like once a year so I thought hey let's go outside film a video about space in the snow. Fucking space.